from the top, what we're gonna do is I'm gonna show you. See that organite right there? Let me let me give you a closer view. See that organite? See, it's an organite pyramid. All right. I have it attached to this leg, which has a quartz point right there. Okay. It's attached to this leg as well, which also has quartz coming out of it and a third leg. All right. So this organite right here, this organite pyramid is attached to all three copper wires that are going down all the way. Remember what I said, it's going down to the earth. Right, and when it's going down, all the way down, 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 it's hitting onto a crystal, which is also surrounded with organite. And there's water also at each corner of the pyramid. So there's crystal, water, and organite. And also has things such as crystal grids and things of that nature. All right, like such as this organite. With the copper legs once again the copper wire is sitting on top of the crystal here all right and this crystal is going the energy of the crystal and the copper is going all the way up 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 up, up to boom at the very top where it hits that organite once again comes down copper wire and as i was saying there's sigils remember i said there's sigils that is wood burn onto the each leg, you have sigils, okay, and they all represent something. So you could put love sigils, you could put power sigils, you could put um, any type of sigil that you choose. Now, once again, this copper wire, okay, which is twisted, as you can see, all right, is going down to this crystal. And this crystal has piezoelectricity in it. This is a large crystal. It's fluorite. You could choose whichever crystal you want. Then I have this tetrahedron or six-pointed star um, crystal grid with organite right here at the bottom, okay, with a selenite tower along with water that you could program. You could speak into your water and organite, all right? So as you sit here in your pyramid, right above you, there is organite octahedron. So you can hang octahedron here, all right? Right with copper, like I did. This is a necklace, one of my necklaces, okay? That I designed and I just pretty much, you know, it's filled with crystals and it's filled with resin and metals and copper and brass and then i have another necklace that i have hanging here with the quartz in it all right and different crystals all right wrapped with copper so um this pretty much it is the pyramid and as i said you can sit here meditate uh and manifest whatever it is that you would want to um bring forth. So if you're saying you want to bring more love into your life, you can use this meditation pyramid for that. If you want to bring abundance into your life, you can use it for that. You can use it for protection. All right. And various, various things. Now, as y'all can see, I also turned the bamboo into a magic wand. Okay. So this one has a fluorite. It has magnetic hematite as well as uh, quartz points, aura quartz points. And this is clear quartz, all wrapped right, with copper, along with finding true love sigil, okay? And uh -oh. all right. Now, some of my pyramid, some of my uh, magic wands are a lot smaller, such as this one right here which is Palo Santo with the uh, point, uh, organite point, rose quartz. You got here, um, organite and amethyst. All of it's wrapped with copper. 
Okay, so these are the tools that can be used when you're uh, working with your the crystal grids. All right, I have a crystal that kind of fell down when I was walking towards the camera, but I, this is the Cedar Life crystal grid. And I have on it Lapis Lazuli, Fluorite, Quartz Point, Amethyst, and I believe this is a Sunstone. All right. As well as I got a Bloodstone. All right. And then I also have some Organite right here. And another Organite Pyramid. And this is on top of Copper. So if you notice, this is in, in the middle of the uh, grid, which is where the dark magic occurs, where you will um, do things such as, you know, work with the crystal grid. You could burn um, some herbs, and you could also be in the middle of this pyramid meditating, all right, on your Sri Yantra, okay? Meditate on your Sri Yantra, all right? Or be, you could be playing an instrument in here and things of that nature. All right. So once again, if you have any questions, feel free to reach out to me. If you see anything that I have that you would like, whether it be a crown, one of my copper rock uh, organite six-pointed star medallions with a hexagon or a necklace. Citrine necklace. This is a lapis lazuli. And this is an organite unk. So, yeah. Thank y'all for tuning in to my um, learning about my meditation pyramid. I love doing this type of work because I feel that it's not just for me, but it's for everybody. It's for this entire planet. Everybody who is interested in helping to elevate the vibration of the planet overall, you know, you know, because as they say, it takes a village to raise a child. And many of us do have children and I'm sure you want your child to grow up in uh, an abundant environment, environment where they can receive healing, where there's people that are not just out to try and kill them, but who want to elevate with them and grow with them and, and enjoying a healthy lifestyle. All right. So, um, Thanks once again for tuning in to my uh, teaching on this pyramid. I will be having more uh, teachings soon. And yeah, so that's pretty much uh, what the pyramid looks like. I'm gonna give a final, final view of the pyramid. Okay, there you go. And as I said, this is easily transportable. It's mobile. It folds up. Um, you have these ropes right here that's holding it. But pretty much it comes loose from the corners. Each corner it comes loose. And you can fold it up and you can walk right outside with it. Set it up in your yard. And work with it outdoors, which is actually the primary main place that you should work with it. Although you can use it indoors okay so especially these winter months all right so that's the bamboo pyramid um thank y'all for uh checking me out for uh coming to my channel make sure that y'all subscribe that you uh share like comment and um give me some feedback on this whole pyramid what your thoughts are and if you're interested in being a part of my um, group, my Royal Light Edutainment Community, where I'll be teaching all about these metaphys metaphysical uh, things that I'm building, such as magic wands, pyramids, crystals, crowns, and things of that nature. All right. So namaste, the God in me, honest the God and goddess in you. Peace. One.